Hi there, remote learners. Today we are going to practice reading and writing the word want for our red words lesson. So make sure you have all the materials that you need, your pencil, your bumpy screen, your blank page, and your red crayon, and then come right back and we'll get started. All right, I'll see you soon. Okay, as you can see, my paper is ready to go. Name goes at the top. Our word for today is the word want. It has four letters. So I would say that we will write it one time across the top and trace it two more times to make sure we write it three times on our bumpy screen. Now the word want is spelled like this. W A N T want. All right, we're gonna write it two more times on our bumpy screen. W-A-N-T, want. One more time. W-A-N-T, want. Nice work. When you're ready, put your not writing finger under that number one. And with your red crayon, let's write the word want. W-A-N-T, want. Not writing finger under the number two, and let's write our word. W-A-N-T, want. Number three, here we go. W-A-N-T. T, want. When you are finished writing it three times on the line, you know what to do. Stand up. It's time for our red words motions. All right, I am standing up. I am ready to go. My writing hand goes up in the air. My not writing hand goes right out in front of me. We're looking at the word while we do our motions so that our brain is receiving the words through our eyes. We can hear it through our ears and our bodies are moving to help us remember. All right, here we go. Ready readers, read. Want, W-A-N-T, want. Writing hand up. Ready readers, read. Want, W-A-N-T, want. One more time. Ready readers, read. Want. W-A-N-T, want. You've got it. What's the next step? Hmm, that's right. Get your ear writing hand out in front of you. We're gonna write the word want three times, making sure to cross over that midline. So write nice and big in the air. Here we go. Ready writers, write. W-A-N-T, want. Two more times. Ready, writers? Write. W A N T. Want. One more time. Here we go. Ready, writers? Write. W A N T. Want. You did it. Now you know what comes next. Fold that paper on the dotted line and let's finish up this red words lesson. Okay, my paper is ready to go. I'm gonna put my not writing finger on that wonder bubble. On the line with your pencil, go ahead and write the word want. Here we go. W-A-N-T, want. Now, if yours does not look just like mine, that's okay. Fix it up and, and make it correct. And remember, that's why we practice these red words, because they are tricky. All right, our sentence for today, I am going to start it and I want you to finish it, meaning you are going to add something that you want at the end. My sentence is going to say, I want a cookie. 
but I want you to write something that you want. Maybe you would say, I want a pizza or I want a Lego. I want you to come up with something to end your sentence with. Let's write our sentence. The first word in our sentence is I. Guess what? That's a red word. We know how to write the word I. I space, because we always have a space between each word, want. W-A-N-T. Want. Hmm. I want a. It's another red word. We know how to write the word a. Uh. Look around, small down, a. Uh. I want a. And I said mine is going to say, I want a cookie. So this is how I'm going to spell cookie. Hook around ka, hook around close, hook around close. Uh, tall down, slant in, slant out, k. Small down, dot, slide, hook around, e. K, u, k, e, cookie. My sentence reads, I want a cookie. But remember, I want yours to say something that you want. I am missing something from my sentence. Who knows what it is? Hmm. I have a capital letter. I have space between my words. Ah, I'm missing a period at the end. That tells the reader it is time to stop. Now, our last step is to underline our red words. Today's red word was want. We also had two other red words in this sentence. I and a. Uh. Nice work, boys and girls. I can't wait to read your sentences. I hope you enjoyed this lesson and I'll see you next time.